Hello, my dear viewers, my well-wishers, and my students. <clears throat> Tonight, I have appeared before you with a new topic, that is phrase preposition or prepositional phrase. You can remember that I have already discussed with you two important topics preposition of time and preposition of place. And tonight I have selected or picked up 11 phrases consisting of preposition. And this is called prepositional phrase. And before starting my lesson or before entering the content, just after the introduction, I am requesting all of you to subscribe my channel, to like, to comment and share. Don't forget to press the bell icon to get more grammatical items. However, what is the phrase? A phrase is a group of words without having any finite verb in it. And this is the difference between phrase and clause. A clause is also a group of words and the part of the sentence, but it has a finite verb in it. But a phrase is a group of words without having any finite verb. And this is called prepositional phrase or phrase preposition because this phrase or all these phrases consist of preposition. My first example is in spite of. In spite of means though or although. Though or although. You know that in complex sentence though or although is used but in a simple sentence though and although are replaced by phrase preposition or prepositional phrase for example in spite of my illness i attended the meeting in spite of my illness i had to attend the party, the evening party. In spite of my poverty, I helped the poor people during the COVID period, etc. In spite of. Now my second item is instead of. Instead of means in exchange of. In exchange of. For example, instead of going to Kolkata instead of going to Kolkata I had to do all my homely affairs or homely duties instead of okay instead of that means Notwithstanding the fact or having all the difficulties or obstacles or hindrances, when somebody is to work, that is called instead of. For example, instead of walking, I had to, uh, instead of walking a long distance in the morning, I had to perform all my homely duties instead of. In exchange of, in exchange of means instead of or for something, for something or that is substituting something, that is substituting something in exchange of. For example, 
in exchange of all these books, in exchange of all these books, I had to buy some new books. That means you had to dispose of the old books and you bought some new books. In exchange of this land, in exchange of this house, the promoter gave me a new flat in exchange of. On account of, on account of means due to or owing to. For example, on account of my illness, I could not attend my classes on account of. In lieu of, in lieu of also means substituting the fact, substituting something. For example, the company has provided me with dividend, with dividends in lieu of profit. The company has provided me with dividend in lieu of profit. In search of, that is looking for, in search of. The old woman entered the forest in search of some dry woods. In search of some dry woods. In search of. Owing to. Owing to means due to. But there is a difference between owing to and due to. For example, owing to deforestation or owing to rapid deforestation, climate is changing first. Climate is changing first. Owing to. And due to, due to means also owing to, but there must be a bivar in a sentence when you are going to use due to. For example, due to my illness, I was absent from my school, from my class, due to my illness, I was absent. You see that was is the form of bivar. When there is bivar, you are at liberty to use due to, and when there is no bivar, you will have to use when to. At home, for example, at home means comfort. Comfort. For example, though it is a new place, though it is an unknown place to me, I feel at home here. I feel at home here. That means I feel easy or comfort here, comfortable here. Okay? Above law. For example, everybody is under law. Nobody is above law. Nobody is above law. Nobody is above the law of God. Clear? Above law. Above his preposition. Across the country. Across the country means all over the country. All over the country, across the country. For example, COVID situation prevailed or COVID situation rapidly spread or broke out across the country. Across the country. Your name and fame has spread across the country. That is all over the country. And I firmly hope that all of you have understood the matter in spite of, instead of, in exchange of, on account of, in lieu of, in search of, going to, due to, at home, above law, across the country. These 11 prepositional phrases have been picked up by me for discussion and I also think that all of you would be able to utilize these phrases to enhance your vocabulary, to enhance your fluency, to enhance your writing and speaking capability. Thanking all of you. Stay safe. Stay below. Good night.